first appearance at these championships. A special anniversary edition, in fact, games held across multiple nations. A true pan-European tournament that is a reflection of the pan-European nature of the game. And this is where it all starts for them. 11 players, many of them friends, some foes during the league season, now united for a single cause as they carry the hopes and expectations of a nation in this grand quadrennial event. Ahead of us, a month of non-stop adrenaline rush. I trust you are strapped in comfortably for what will be, at least for partisan parties, the most unbearable, thrilling of emotional roller coasters. This is one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Well, that was impressive. Match that. Here it is then, the first page of the first chapter of this special tournament. All I hope is that these nations, as well as the players of course, can make a good account of themselves. And I also like the fact that such excitement isn't just something that one host country has the monopoly of. It's shared by so many people across the continent, literally, and that certainly created a, an extra special buzz. Got things on the way. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Virgil van Dijk. He's just about unbeatable in every department, Peter. He's strong, he's quick, he's totally dominant. That's a foul, no two ways about it. De Ligt is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. Yeah, and he has to change his ways, or... Up to meet it! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. The room. Koeman. It's anyone's ball. The room. Bubble. And it's Memphis Depay. Wijnaldum gets it out to the wing. Lobs it in gently. Mondi. Lamar. Conte. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. A promising ball. And here's to Pai. He's through. They've managed to get it away. Coleman. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push. Um... He'll try from distance. Good first touch and almost as good a second. Ah, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. Loris, will they claim to that?
Van Dijk. Barbel. Feinaldum. Barbel. The room. And it's hoisted clear. Martial. Tolisso. So it is still nil-nil. Rafael Varane. Titi Rafael Baran tries to get it forward quickly. He's looked long this time. He's played him through. But goes for goal! And they've been caught out here. And it's Vinaldo. are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. The Netherlands break the deadlock. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Titi plays it over to the other flank. Conte. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Berghaus plays it forward, just... To... It's Memphis to play! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. So that's two now without reply. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Conte into the final five minutes of the first half. The Netherlands have scored two quick goals here and are firmly in the driving seat. 2-0 the score. So was it all, wasn't it? Well. You be the judge, but he did look very, very willing to go down. Yeah, I agree, Peter. I don't think there was any contact. My fi and that's one back! Oh, dispatched with certainty. Well, the keeper probably felt he could read that, but he's guessed completely wrongly. He's going to the other side. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. The lifts. Berghaus plays a clever pass. Rafael Varane hoists it forward. 
Martial. There is the half-time whistle. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. The Netherlands leading by one in a finely poised game. It is intriguing to watch and could easily go either way. And the game has already resumed here. Mbappe has a shot! Just brushed off the ball there. And he has been fouled there. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. It's broken loose. Durant, foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. The Netherlands have it back and they can go again. And it's got through. Gets the better of his man. Memphis Depay. He's tried one. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal. And he didn't go for the back heel. Collective sigh of relief from the defence. Pogba. Coman. Coman drives it forward. That's great strength on the ball. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. This isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Berghaus. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Oh, real danger here. Time to deliver. He's had a goal! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. And it's played forward. Conte. Lamar. Get a throw in. And it's the Roan. Conte. Into the last quarter of an hour. Rafael Varan. And Titi. Rafael Varane, forward it goes. Oh, it's a searing run, he is a man on a mission. And he's there to cut it out. Oh, he's not going to get that. And that is as far as they're going to go. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Martial. Coman. Barbel is steaming forward. Memphis Depay. He's got it on the right now. What's on? Barbel has set up one goal so far. 
He's in space and looking for options. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Time for a change in personnel. So we have a double... There's the shot! Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. It is just a question of running down the clock now. He goes long. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. And that's clear cut. That's a free kick. Rafael Varane. We are into overtime. He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. Rafael Varane. Conte. They are right into last chance territory. And there goes the final whistle. The Netherlands got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one, and it goes well for the campaign ahead. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Listen, ideally, any new campaign...